Well, there are many great institutions of higher education around the state of Nebraska. Often the University of Nebraska comes to mind, but there are other schools that offer students great opportunities as well. In this segment, we discover Peru State College and hear more about the opportunities students have there to build a bright future. Peru State College is engaging students and giving them an edge in the working world. For example, the school offers three criminal justice majors where students get important training. We have a Milo simulator that allows us to work on de-escalation techniques that are basically in a no-fault environment. That if they make a mistake or it doesn't go well, it doesn't hurt anything and we just start over. As opposed to if a student doesn't get these opportunities and they have to learn when they get to where they're going, they will be less successful if they haven't had the practice. Students also learn how to process crime scenes and deal with jail cell incidents. Criminal justice majors also benefit from the Correctional Leadership Scholarship Program. It provides scholarship money while students get hands-on experience working at the Tecumseh State Correctional Institution. This could lead to future employment. They have the opportunity to, to hire on at corrections at, at maybe even a potentially higher rate because they've gone through this leadership academy with the Department of Corrections. So instead of, of having their foot in the door just now as graduating college, they would actually be a few steps ahead of others that had just walked in the door. Students are also getting unique training in the Tell Lab at Peru State's College of Education. So what the Tell is is our teaching experience learning lab. The lab gives future teachers a chance to experience the most up-to-date classrooms they might encounter. So what this provides for our candidates is an opportunity to experience flexible seating. Uh, and what's the beauty of that is, is the classrooms can be transformed within minutes to look however they want it to look to fit the needs of students. Students are also exposed to innovative technology. We've got smart boards, we've got one-to-one -one devices. Uh, and also what's really unique is this allows students and our candidates to actually record their own teaching. And as you might imagine, the learning continues in the College of Arts and Sciences. At the Performing Arts Center at Peru State, you are bound to find any number of events happening, like the show choir camp. And in this organic chemistry lab, students build bonds with one another. One of the things we do offer in the sciences is uh, undergraduate mentored research. So we have scientists that are practicing scientists, and so they would get grants, and they would have students work on those grants. It's a place where people don't just go to work and go home, go to classes and go home. They belong here. Peru State President Michael Evans says he's excited about what's happening now at the college, but he says the future looks bright as well. Among the things we're working on right now is something we call Project ROAR, and that stands for Renewed Opportunities for Activity and Recreation, and it's going to result in five new buildings on campus that will more than double the space we have available for recreation, uh, junior varsity, intramural teams, club sports, all those sorts of things. And the real goal is to get students up and get them moving. And as the future of Peru State College continues to take shape, students are taking advantage of what's offered right now and making the most of their time at this small and well-rounded college.